Yeah, I'm feeling it. We just coming right back after I finalized my final prank. Right. Oh, you had a what? Final prank on Beth. Wait, 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 this one's gonna get her. Is it? Do you have it done already? No. When is it? Need her, oh, out, the, need her out the room. What? You will tell her. I bro. actually won't tell her. I you actually. Fill a big garbage bag with water and put it in her bag, and when she picks it up, it's gonna go everywhere. And what? When she picks up her bag, it's just gonna go everywhere. Like the water's gonna be in the bag? It's gonna be in a garbage bag in the bag. Like under her clothes? Just in there somewhere. When she picks it up, the water just gonna go everywhere. <laughs> That's actually genius. So it was, it's not gonna be like tied though. No. It's gonna be kind of tied, but tied in a way where like, like when it moves, it'll, like, it too much, yeah. it's gonna come loose. So her all her clothes are inside. Everything will get wet. Her, her clothes, everything. <laughs> it's genius. Hopefully, it's not her shit that she wants to wear for the HOH. I mean, the eviction. Well, <laughs> <laughs> she wears pajamas to the fucking eviction. <laughs> That's actually a good one. She could just throw it in the dryer at the end of the day. Realistically. Yeah. Oh my god. Where should, we, where should I sit in the same spot? I don't want to I need her out the room for like 10 minutes though if I'm gonna get it done. Cause right. the garbage bag's by the tub behind Oh, me. you got it ready? Yeah, it's ready, bro. I just need time. We could get her out of there. <laughs> you have it prepared? I'm sick. But I didn't want her to catch me mid. So you're gonna put it under the clothes. This yeah. is gonna fucking go everywhere, right? But even before she even moves. No, no, no. If it's if it's tied, it has it's to gonna be here all night. Huh? So it's gonna be in here all night. It's gonna get her at some point. It's gonna be soaking wet before she even tries to move it. No, it'll be in the bag. I don't know how you're gonna maneuver this water to not move at all. As soon as she moves the bag, she the bag will have to move in order for the water to move. I'm gonna see how this works. <laughs> I'm not an engineer. I don't know if I can make it happen perfectly. <laughs> I'm not a fucking architect. <laughs> it don't work, just kick her fucking bag. <laughs> just kick her bag. Oh, man. Oh, uh, this is gonna suck, boys. Yeah, this is gonna suck, man. This is literally tearing someone's dream away from them. Well, Vic. we've been doing it, yeah. so. <laughs> we have been doing it, that's fair. Yeah, and Vic's done it to two people. It burns me because she protected us. Yeah, I know. I feel bad, man. Twice. Well. I just don't want to regret anything. Ish. She took, she, she hit us and she doesn't even really know it. That's the other part though. With who? LT? LT, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you meant It else. was a hit even if she missed. Yeah. You know what I mean? No, it was. Like, it would have been you. Yeah. True. That's very true. And the LT wanted her to go next. Yeah, I know. Her, it would have been, if it was in a perfect world, it would have been Victor and Kyle. Yep. This one's for LT, man. Yeah. At the end of the day. Well, not, this isn't going to be just a fucking breaking the news situation here. I think it's going to be more. Uh, what up, Mama Sick Talk? Hmm? I'm going to come in. Where are they? I'm sorry? Where are they? Uh, downstairs. They just said they're coming. Let me grab a... coming up? No. No. Let me grab a croissant real quick. Do they make fresh ones? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm good, actually. I'm good. I'm good, thanks. I've eaten too much. I ate a lot. I started working out today. <laughs> Jed, you don't want me here? You? Yeah. In the house? Yeah. I definitely want you here. I definitely want you here, Vic. Then why don't you keep me here? Uh, oh, I mean, it's not my decision solely. Um, I don't know. There's a lot of shit going on in this house. I've been honest about everything. Yeah. Yeah, everything. Yeah, I know. Everything I said is the truth about yeah. wanting to fight with you guys about people in this house. Yeah. About it being the wrong time for me to go. Like, everything. Like, what? Like I don't know. Like, I don't know why you guys don't want me to fight with you guys. It's not that we don't want you to fight with us. 
there's just like so much shit going on in this house that's like no no one really knows and it's and it's started so i get the like the ground end of it no it's just like we've had stuff in this house the whole game you know what i mean like and it's just, I don't know, it's tough. Like, it's just, it's tough. Because, like, a lot of the th scenarios and situations that you pitch to us won't happen because of the way the house is set up at the moment, you know? Like, it's hard because we can't, like, can't really say anything, but I know you'll, you'll understand. Like, you will understand. That's all I can really like, why say. did you come with me like with the a lot like I don't get that in the Aldi room. Yeah, I mean thank you. Thank you. Like I, all everything was genuine, like everything is genuine. What's going on, babe? You guys don't want me here? It's just Oh, thank you. As much as you tell us, love, like, there's things we don't know, it's vice versa. Like, there's stuff I don't know you guys mean? And I really hope, like, when you go home and watch, you're like, fuck yeah, guys. Okay. Like, I hope we could be actually fucking ourselves right now. We really could be. We are. We definitely are. You definitely are. You're just getting rid of someone who's like for you guys, willing to do anything for you guys, fight with you guys. Like there's no no way, shape or form is that a good move for anybody in a game like this. You keep people that are fighting for you, that are going for the people that you're going for. You know what I mean? And that's something you can just be certain of with me, you know? But it's okay. Like I've I mean, literally, there's nothing else I could say. Like I've laid it all out. If it's not enough, it's not enough. That is literally why we're sitting here Wednesday night, like, fucking upset. I just don't want you guys to make the wrong move. Like at least, like there's a lot of unknown stuff in the house. But what's not like unknown is that I am gunning for these other people. I have been loyal for you. I have made big moves for you guys. And that's the thing. Like I've literally never felt like such a big dick in my entire life. Like you actually have been such a big part of why we're all sitting here right now and you should listen to that like you should listen to that like think about this big brother and what we're doing right now and what the objective of the game is do you know what i mean i know what you mean like this this is the ideal thing right here these open conversations the truth having all different types of people working together to get to the same goal like, I literally, like, you guys know Spicy V. Like, I am such, like, an upbeat, outgoing person that all I need is to stay. Like, literally, and the, I'll have the biggest smile and we can go. Like, I worry that you guys think, like, I'm not going to be able to go back to how things were or something. Honestly, this choice actually has nothing to do with that, like, at all. We know that you would be, like, down and loyal and with us. Like, we actually trust you 100. So what's the issue? Like, what was the reason? We actually can't say anything. Like, I hope that you go home and you watch stuff and you're like, oh, okay. cool. Like a different alliance? Not really, but like, just know be that like, we really trust you and everything we've done until this point has been genuine, for real. And like, you're the real fucking deal. That's why we were with you. And this kills us. Like, it actually is the worst. I don't feel like it does or else you guys wouldn't do it. Like, I'm not asking you guys, like, to, like, like, I don't even want to go all the way. I just don't want to go out this week. Like, I will literally go on the block next week. I don't care who wins. I will go next week happily. It's just going the week after I did this for us. Like, that's, like, I don't think I'll ever be able to get over that. That's, that's just so hard. Like, like, that's really cruel, guys. Like, just, it really is. Like, this is a game. You don't have to do this to somebody. You know what I mean? It is a game, and that's what we constantly to remind ourselves because if this wasn't a game decision love like we wouldn't even be having this conversation with you okay there's really nothing else and i really believe that like maybe i don't know what it is tomorrow but the physical ones the number ones like i'm literally just going to be a shield to go i just worry you guys are making the wrong decision but you guys are smart there must be a bigger picture i'm not upset i get it but just know that 
it, like I can't, I literally can't think of any scenario where this is the right choice for your guys' game. Like, dead ass. Like, I really can't. I don't think there's anything. I could be a shield for you guys next week. It's coming. I honestly just don't think, like, in the, in the, in the long run, I don't think you are a shield. Because I don't think Roe puts you up. I think Roe sticks to what he wants and puts us up, no matter what. Because at that point, it's like, what's the point of putting you up when we were literally in a position to backdoor you and he sees an opportunity to pull you to him? He can't pull me to him. I literally hate him. He has the ability. I'm with you guys. That no. wouldn't happen. He's like a master manipulator. Like, he has the ability I'm to do I'm not interested. It. No, he doesn't. Like, no, he fucking doesn't. I see right through it. After what I saw yesterday, yeah, fucking right, Jed. I know, I just, like, the... I, I'm a vote, I'm a number, like, I'm everything I think you guys need. It's okay, if you guys don't feel the same way, like, that's fine. I just, like, I just, I still don't get it, that's all. I want to yeah. get it, I want to leave getting it, like, you know what I mean? But I just yeah. don't. Like, you'll, you'll get it, like, you will get it. Why don't you just tell me, or, like, something? I'm not upset about the decision, know, I'm just upset. Just come this far. Like, why did I do that? Like, why did I do all of this stuff for you guys? I thought we were working together, this is crazy. It doesn't have to be this week, guys. Get me out next week. Like, I literally... I feel like we've thought about this long and hard for so long. Okay. For so long. And it's like, it's not about how much we love you. I know, it's I'm not, not saying that at all. I'm it, talking about the game. I'm talking about the game and what I think the right move is for you guys. And the reality is the scenario of you being a shield for us like Jed said, is an, it, it might not even be a realistic one. And then if you're not going to win comps either, I just think we've looked at so many scenarios and talked about it in so many ways for so long. Okay. And it's... Like, you'll really understand. Like, and I'm telling you, you will understand. As a fan of the show, you will understand. And I hope that you just, like, we do love you so much. And I hope that you just trust that if you were in this position and you were in the situation we were in, you would make the same move. And as a fan, you will understand. Like, I know you say Canada is watching and Canada will be disappointed, but I don't think they will be because of the unknown. And that's what I can tell you truthfully. And like, you will find out and you will be like, shit. I can't believe you guys are gonna keep terror over me. Like, I just, this is such a bad it's move. It's not guys. a Tara thing, it's not. No, I know, but oh my God, that side is gonna come for you. You guys don't think they are, it's okay. It's okay, like, they're coming, they're coming either way. And if you're here, they're coming. And if and they're not coming for you, they're coming for us, either way. Either way, tomorrow we need to win. If Roe wins tomorrow, we're fucked if you're here or not. It doesn't matter. So, I think like, I would go up, but, I and I also would be a vote for what it, like, for you guys, where you guys want it. Like, it's But like, if, if it's us three on the block, like, it doesn't matter at that point. Like, it doesn't, and one of us is going home no matter what. So it's like, at the end of the day, if Roe wins is the worst scenario, whether you're here, whether you're not here, we, we need to win tomorrow no matter what. So it's like... There's a better chance of you guys winning if I'm here to fight with you guys. Like, f the numbers. I know, but it's just like, we have things set in place that are kind of covering our bases at the moment, and it's just like, it's just, it's a game decision. It's really not personal at all. Like, it isn't. And like, you know our relationship has been solid from the for the whole game. And it's just like, it, I swear to God, like you're a fan of the game. When you see it, you will you will not be mad. All right. I'm like it's it's a shitty situation. I feel terrible. We all feel terrible. I just don't know why it has to be this week. The week after I made the biggest move. That's for you the guys. worst part. It is literally the worst part. Like I don't get that. Like you guys could literally put me up next week. I wouldn't care. Like it's just to go out. Like that is like, it's just not it. Like, you guys can literally put me up next week. I don't care. Like, if there's anything I can do to change your mind, please let me know. I just don't want to go home this week. That's literally it. Yeah. Like, is there any scenario where you guys can think of that could keep me in this game with you another week? Like, literally nothing's out of the equation. Like, literally. Only other option was if Roe went. Is if so? What? Sorry. If, if Roe went this week, that was it. Like that was our main point. That was it. 
That was our only other option this week, Vic. That was all real. I know. I feel like I failed you on that one. I'm sorry. That's, That's okay, Ty. It's all good. I just, wow. I didn't think you guys had to do me like this, like really backdoor me, like that's crazy. We're supposed to be working together, like what? I did everything you guys asked in this game, like that is just so shady. It's just like I said, our plan was, bro. Yeah. Who the fuck thinks someone can win three vetoes in a row? That's why I wanna be here to help you guys fight for it, like fight for that not to happen. Like that's my only motive here. No one in this game is gonna be more than that, literally. I mean, yeah, I mean, I mean, it's a tough situation, but at the end of the day, it's just like, we made, like, we, we decided we're, we're making a game move. Like, it's not an emotional move. Okay. If it was emotional, like, you know how it would be. I just don't, like, we, we just, there's bigger things in place, and it's just like, you understand. I swear to God, you understand. And there's just a lot of conflicting shit going on in this house. But we've made it this far by playing clean game, and... This is not a clean move. <laughs> in the grand scheme of things, like, this is what, this is, this is our only other option. Like, we said Roe was our option this week. And then when he took himself down, we're like, we only have really one other option. And that was it. Because at the end of the day, Tara has no longevity in this game, realistically. So like she isn't coming. But she through. literally she, does though. She, she literally she is making it another week. She she she's making another week because of us again. It's crazy. That's she crazy. Isn't, you she isn't do coming that for, for her us. over me. We're not like. <laughs> I know you guys are, like I don't know. Like You're would like would you like I don't, I don't know like would you rather be in this situation like next week? Like you say that now, yes, but like, like you I wouldn't. swear over my life, over my boyfriend's life. But it's like, if we're playing emotions, like, we care about you enough to not want to put you in that situation again. I would literally rather that. The situation is that I made a move publicly to Canada, explained my reasoning, and it was for you guys. And then two episodes later, they're going to see you guys backdoor me. Like, that's going to be really fucking hard. <laughs> like, literally. Like, I literally made that move for you guys on national television. They weren't coming for me, and I even said that. You guys might think I'm crazy for putting up Ray and Austin because they're not coming for me, but they're coming for my alliance, and that's like they're coming for me. That's what I said. Doesn't smell great. Oh, <laughs> uh, cause you, you have your stuff. I don't know if I even put deodorant right, on today. Yeah. My lips have been dry like for the lotion. Last... You think I carry uh, lotion on me now too? Oh, can you? I used to in my satchel. Okay, in a a satchel? Do I look like I have a fucking satchel? Why don't you wear one all day? I'll be fire. I have Swaggy. one. Swaggy. I should have. I should have brought one just to have on me all day. So I'm like, around yeah, my. I debated bringing mine, but mine has like, on the strap. His logo. What logo? Uh, it's like this like UK brand. Oh okay. You yeah. got some UK brands in though. This. Oh no, those other pants, the green ones. Yeah. You got those yeah. in. Yeah, this one I don't know if I would have been able to. It looks kind of like uh, the off brand, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wait, the one you're wearing? The, the green one? No, the black bag. Oh, it looks like the off brand. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, big oversight on that one. Yeah. Like, I didn't bring any of my real stuff. Of course you didn't. I just ordered a bunch of stuff on Bezos. I was like, this is what I'm wearing. <laughs> the fuck up. <laughs> I was very like, I need expensive things that don't have, you know, big brands on them. First, I was gonna get expensive big brands, and then the, it was like, nah. So I was like, okay. Okay. Yeah, I almost bought a pair of the Y's before I came. Same. All black. Same. Triple black. Same. Like, oh, they're looking nice. Same. Can't see the logo. Eight bills. I was like, eight? Which ones? Triple blacks. But what, like, what ones? Like, mm. the. Oh which, oh, which ones? Which ones were they? Like, do they look like rows? Like rose. Like rose gray shoes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They yeah, look yeah. like that? Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Mine were chunky. And I was gonna get the wave. You know what I'm talking about? 
The oh, wire, yeah. yeah. Those ones? They kind of look like my Pumas yeah. that I have in here. That's why you thought they were... Yeah. Then it was... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, are we doing this, or am I going to bed? Ah! Yeah. Oh, I want to barf. Hmm? Yo, we going to be all right. Was her pitch fed, at least? It was the same thing. Oh. The Just same thing with some tears. It was really sad. Tears. Oh. Okay, come on, Holmes. We got to get it done. Are you bringing her in here? Yeah. Here we go. Yes, ma'am. Unless you want to be... <laughs> We're gonna have him in here. here. No, no, ring leader. No, no, no. Just him all perched up like this. <laughs> Taisha lips. Ah. Taisha. Oh. Little bit of Taisha no. and Taiolo. Ah. Not Taisha, Taiolo. <laughs> You're alter ego. Taiolo. We have so many in this house. I love you, Bray. Love you too. Bray, bray. Hey, Bray, bye. Aren't you so glad you're not a part of this shit? What? Aren't you so glad you're not a part of this? Oh, I mean, you want to be? No. No, you fucking don't. I really wish I could go with you and we could hang on. Turn to a bat. They're into the moss. Is the broom still in the pantry? Yes. This the is moves. driving me insane. The broom. I need to sweep our room. Our room? No. The hall, OLG? The, best, the, the hallway destiny thing, the destiny defender hallway. Oh. Yeah. Are we upstairs? I'm gonna I'm, oh. No, I'm gonna come fill my water with you. You want a crescent? If you see mine, could you grab mine down there, Beth? What? Totally. Where is my water bottle? Please don't put anything <laughs> in my water bottle. I actually will chill with the water bottles. You want mine? Yeah, I'm filling it. I think she's coming right back after I finalized my final prank. Right. Oh, Hannah? You know what? Final prank hey. on Beth. Where, where is this it? one's gonna get her. Is it? Do you have it done already? No. When is it? Need, oh, her, out the, need her out the room. What? You will tell her. I actually won't tell her. I you actually. Fill a big garbage bag with water and put it in her bag, and when she picks up, it's going everywhere. And what? When she picks up her bag, it's just going to go everywhere. Like the water's going to be in the bag? It's going to be in a garbage bag in the bag. Like under her clothes? Just in there somewhere. When she picks it up, the water's just going to go everywhere. <laughs> That's actually genius. So it was, it's not going to be like tied, though? No. It's going to be kind of tied, but tied in a way where, like, like when it moves, it'll like. Too much, yeah. and it's going to come loose. So her, all her clothes are going to get Everything will get wet. Her, her clothes, everything. It's genius. Hopefully it's not her shit that she wants to wear for the HOH. I mean, the eviction. Well. <laughs> <laughs> she wears pajamas to the fucking eviction. <laughs> That's actually a good one. She could just throw it in the dryer at the end of the day. Realistically. Yeah. Oh, my God. Where should, we, where should I sit in the same spot? I don't want to be... I need her out the room for, like, ten minutes, though, if I'm going to get it done. Oh, yeah. the garbage bag's by the tub behind Oh, me. you got it ready? Yeah, it's ready, bro. I just need time. <laughs> We could get her out of it. <laughs> you have it prepared? I'm sick. But I didn't want her to catch me mid. So you're gonna put it fill. under the clothes. This yeah. is gonna fucking go everywhere, right? But before she even moves. No, no, no. If it's if it's tied, it has it's gonna to be, be here all night. Huh? So it's gonna be in here all night. It's gonna get her at some point. It's gonna be soaking wet before she even tries to move it. No, it'll be in the bag. I don't know how you're gonna maneuver this water to not move at all. As soon as she moves the bag, she the bag will have to move in order for the water to move. I ain't gonna see how this works. <laughs> I'm not an engineer. I don't know if I can make it happen perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a fucking architect. <laughs> it don't work. Just kick her fucking bag. <laughs> just kick her bag. Oh man. Oh, this is gonna suck, boys. Yeah, this is gonna suck, man. This is literally tearing someone's dream away from them. Well, we've been doing it, yeah. so... We have been doing it, that's fair. Yeah, and Vic's done it to two people. It burns me because she protected us. Yeah, I know. I feel bad, man. Twice. Well, I just don't want to regret anything. Ish. She took... She, she hit us, and she doesn't even really know it. That's the other part, though. With who? LT? LT, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's it else. was a hit, even if she missed. Yeah. You know what I mean? No, it was. Like, it would have been you. Yeah. True. That's very true. And the L team wanted her to go next. Yeah, I know. Her, it would have been, if it was in a perfect world, it would have been Victor and Kyle. Yep. This one's for LT, man. Yeah. At the end of the day. We're not, this isn't going to be just a fucking breaking the news situation here. I think it's going to be more. What up, Mama Sister? What are they? I'm sorry? What are they? Uh, downstairs, they're, they're coming. Let me grab Are you a, coming up? No, no. Let me grab a croissant real quick. 
Anyone Do they make fresh ones? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm good, actually. I'm good. I'm good, thanks. I've eaten too much. I ate a lot. I worked out today. <laughs> Jed, you don't want me here? You? Yeah. In the house? Yeah. I definitely want you here. I definitely want you here, Vic. So why don't you keep me here? Uh, oh, I mean, it's not my decision solely. I've been honest about everything. Yeah. Yeah, everything. Yeah, I know. Everything I said is the truth about yeah. wanting to fight with you guys, about people in this house. Yeah. About yeah. it being the wrong time for me to go. Like, everything. Like, what? Like I don't know. Like, I don't know why you guys don't want me to fight with you guys. It's not that we don't want you to fight with us. There's just, like, so much shit going on in this house that's, like... No, no one really knows, and it's and it's started. So I get the like the ground end of it. No, it's just like we've had stuff in this house the whole game. You know what I mean? Like, and it's just I don't know. It's tough. Like it's just it's tough because like a lot of the scenarios and situations that you pitch to us won't happen because of the way the house is set up at the moment, you know? Like, it's hard because we can't, like, can't really say anything, but I know you'll, you'll understand. Like, you will understand. Okay. That's all I can but really why say. Why did you come with me, like, with the, like, I don't get that in the Aldi room? Yeah, I mean, thank you. Thank you. Like, all, everything was genuine, like, everything is genuine. What's going on, babe? You guys don't want me here? It's just... Oh, thank you. As much as you tell us you love, like, there's things we don't know, it's vice versa. Like, there's stuff I don't know you guys mean? And I really hope, like, when you go home and watch, you're like, fuck yeah, guys. Okay. Like, I hope. We could be actually fucking ourselves right now. We really could be. We are. We definitely are. You definitely are. You're just getting rid of someone who is like for you guys, willing to do anything for you guys, fight with you guys. Like there's no, no way, shape or form is that a good move for anybody in a game like this. You keep people that are fighting for you, that are going for the people that you're going for. You know what I mean? And that's something you can just be certain of with me, you know? But it's okay, like I've literally, there's nothing else I could say. Like I've laid it all out. If it's not enough, it's not enough. That is literally why we're sitting here Wednesday night, like fucking upset. I just don't want you guys to make the wrong move. Like at least, like there's a lot of unknown stuff in the house, but what's not like unknown is that I am gunning for these other people. I have been loyal for you. I have made big moves for you guys. And that's the thing, like I've literally never felt like such a big dick in my entire life. Like you, actually have been such a big part of why we're all sitting here right now and you should listen to that like you should listen to that like think about this big brother and what we're doing right now and what the objective of the game is do you know what i mean i know what you mean like this is the ideal thing right here these open conversations the truth having all different types of people working together to get to the same goal like, I literally, like, you guys know Spicy V. Like, I am such, like, an upbeat, outgoing person that all I need is to stay. Like, literally, and then I'll have the biggest smile and we can go. 
Like, I worry that you guys think, like, I'm not going to be able to go back to how things were or something. Honestly, this choice actually has nothing to do with that, like, at all. We know that you would be, like, down and loyal and with us. Like, we actually trust you 100. So what's the issue? Like, what was the reason? I, we actually can't say anything. Like, I hope that you go home and you watch stuff and you're like, oh, okay. cool. Like a different alliance? Not really, but, like, just know, be that, like, we really trust you and everything we've done until this point has been genuine. For real. And, like, you're the real fucking deal. That's why we were with you. And this kills us. Like, it actually is the worst. I don't feel like it does, or else you guys wouldn't do it. Like, I'm not asking you guys, like, to, like... Like, I don't even want to go all the way. I just don't want to go out this week. Like, I will literally go on the block next week. I don't care who wins. I will go next week happily. It's just going the week after I did this for us. Like, that's... Like, I don't think I'll ever be able to get over that. That's, that's just so hard. Like, like, that's really cruel, guys. Like, just, it really is. Like, this is a game. You don't have to do this to somebody. You know what I mean? It is a game, and that's what we constantly have to remind ourselves. Because if this wasn't a game decision, well, like, we wouldn't even be having this conversation with you. Okay. There's really nothing else. I really believe that. Like, maybe, I don't know what it is tomorrow. But the physical ones, the number ones, like, I'm literally just going to be a shield to go. I just worry you guys are making the wrong decision. But you guys are smart. There must be a bigger picture. I'm not upset. I get it. But just know that, it, like, I can't, I literally can't think of any scenario where this is the right choice for your guys' game. Like, dead ass. Like, I really can't. I don't think there's anything. I could be a shield for you guys next week. It's coming. I also just don't think, like, in the, in the, in the long run, I don't think you are a shield because I don't think Ro puts you up. I think Ro sticks to what he wants and puts us up no matter what. Because at that point, it's like, what's the point of putting you up when we were literally in a position to backdoor you and he sees an opportunity to pull you to him? He can't pull me to him. I literally hate him. He has the ability. I am with you guys. That no. wouldn't happen. He's like a master manipulator. Like, he has the ability I'm to do I'm not interested. It. No, he doesn't. Like, no, he fucking doesn't. I see right through it. After what I saw yesterday, yeah, fucking right, Jed. I know. I just, like, the... I, I'm a vote. I'm a number. Like, I'm everything I think you guys need. It's okay. If you guys don't feel the same way, like, that's fine. I just, like, I just, I still don't get it. That's all. I want to get it. I want to leave getting it. Like, you know what I mean? But I just yeah. don't. Like, you'll, you'll get it. Like, you will get it. Why don't you just tell me? Or, like, something. I'm not upset about the decision. Know, I'm just upset. Just come this far. Like, why did I do that? Like, why did I do all of this stuff for you guys? I thought we were working together. This is crazy. It doesn't have to be this week, guys. Get me out next week. Like, I literally... I feel like we've thought about this long and hard for so long. Okay. For so long. And it's like, it's not about how much we love you. I know, it's I'm not, not saying that at all. I'm it, talking about the game. I'm talking about the game and what I think the right move is for you guys. And the reality is the scenario of you being a shield for us, like Jed said, is an, it, it might not even be a realistic one. And then if you're not going to win comps either, it's, <sighs> I just think we've looked at so many scenarios and talked about it in so many ways for so long. Okay. And it's... Like, you'll really understand. Like, and I'm telling you, you will understand. As a fan of the show, you will understand. And I hope that you just, like, we do love you so much. And I hope that you just trust that if you were in this position and you were in the situation we were in, you would make the same move. And as a fan, you will understand. Like, I know you say Canada is watching and Canada will be disappointed, but I don't think they will be because of the unknown. And that's what I can tell you truthfully. And, like, you will find out and you will be like, shit. I can't believe you guys are going to keep Tara over me. Like, I just, this is such a bad thing. It's not guys. a Tara thing. It's not. No, I know, but oh my God, that side is going to come for you. You guys don't think they are. It's okay. It's okay. Like, they're coming, they're coming either way. And if you're here, they're coming. And if and they're not coming for you, they're coming for us. Either way, either way, tomorrow we need to win. If Ro wins tomorrow, we're fucked. If you're here or not, it doesn't matter. So I think like, I would go up, but, I and I also would be a vote for what it like for you guys, where you guys want it. Like it's 
But like if, if it's us three on the block, like it doesn't matter at that point. Like it doesn't. And one of us is going home no matter what. So it's like at the end of the day, it, if Roe wins is the worst scenario. Whether you're here, whether you're not here, we we need to win tomorrow no matter what. So it's like there's a better chance of you guys winning if I'm here to fight with you guys. Like the numbers. I know, but it's just like we have things set in place that are kind of covering our bases at the moment and it's just like it's just it's a game decision it's really not personal at all like it isn't and like you know our relationship has been solid from the for the whole game and it's just like it, i swear to god like you're a fan of the game when you see it you will you will not be mad all right and like it's it's a shitty situation i feel terrible we all feel terrible. I just don't know why it has to be this week, the week after I made the biggest move That's for you the guys. worst part. It is literally the worst part. Like, I don't get that. Like, you guys could literally put me up next week. I wouldn't care. Like, it's just to go out like that is like, it's just not it. Like, you guys can literally put me up next week. I don't care. Like, if there's anything I can do to change your mind, please let me know. I just don't want to go home this week. That's literally it. Yeah. Like, is there any scenario where you guys can think of that could keep me in this game with you another week? Like, literally nothing's out of the equation. Like, literally. Your only other option was if Roe went. Is if, so what, sorry? If, if Roe went this week, that was it. Like, that was our main point. That was it. That was our only other option this week, Vic. That was all real. I know. I feel like I failed you on that one. I'm sorry. It's That's okay, Ty. Okay. It's all good. I just, wow. I didn't think you guys had to do me like this. Like, really backdoor me. Like, that's crazy. We're supposed to be working together. Like, what? <clears throat> I did everything you guys asked in this game. Like, that is just so shady. It's just like I said, our plan was, bro. Yeah. Who the okay. fuck thinks someone can win three vetoes in a row? That's why I want to be here to help you guys fight for it. Like, fight for that not to happen. Like, that's my only motive here. No one in this game is going to be more than that. Literally. I mean, yeah, I mean. I mean, it's a tough situation, but at the end of the day, it's just like, we made, like, we, we decided we're, we're making a game move. Like, it's not an emotional move. Okay. If it was emotional, like, you know how it would be. I just don't like we we just there's bigger things in place and it's just like you understand I swear to God you understand and there's just a lot of conflicting shit going on in this house but we've made it this far by playing clean game and this is not a clean move <laughs> in the grand scheme of things like this is what this is this is our only other option like we said. Roe was our option this week. And then when he took himself down, we're like, we only have really one other option. And that was it. Because at the end of the day, Tara has no longevity in this game, realistically. So, like, she isn't coming But she for, literally she, does, though. She, she literally she is making it another week. She, she, she's making it another week because of us again. It's crazy. She That's crazy you she isn't do coming that for, for her us. over me. We're not, like... <laughs> I know you guys are like I don't know. Like just, would like would you like I don't, I don't know. Like would you rather be in this situation like next week? Like you say that now, yes, but like, like you wouldn't. I swear over my life, over my boyfriend's life. But it's like if we're playing emotions, like we care about you enough to not want to put you in that situation again. I would literally rather that the situation is that I made a move publicly to Canada, explained my reasoning, and it was for you guys. And then two episodes later, they're gonna see you guys backdoor me. Like that's gonna be really fucking hard. Like, literally. Like, I literally made that move for you guys on national television. They weren't coming for me, and I even said that. You guys might think I'm crazy for putting up Ray and Austin because they're not coming for me, but they're coming for my alliance, and that's like they're coming for me. That's what I said. I mean, at the end of the day, like, I'm not playing this game for Canada. I was just about to say that when she cut yeah, me off. Like, I, like, I, I get that it's national television, yeah. but... 
was like, I don't really care about the optics if it, at the end of the day it helps us move forward. Too. The optics is Canada knows we've been sunsetters from fucking day three. Uh, That's what I mean, like. Fighting hard for us. That's it. This we, is the best move for our lines that we created on day three. It is. We took her in to take a shot at the other house and we got locked out exactly. by her becoming the invisible agent. Exactly. We, we, as an alliance, built a relationship with her for this exact reason. We didn't do it to have a full-on alliance with her. We did it so that she could make moves for us in the event that she won. And that's exactly what happened. So we played this game. We played it harder. Like, it, it, it's Big Brother. At the end of the day, it's, maybe it's seen as a dirty move, but this is Big Brother. The reality is our plan was to send her home next week anyway. Exactly. So like she was on her heels. And it was honest. We what was the what was our number one? Yeah. We wanted her to go home this week. All right. Like this wasn't I told her. I'm like, I failed you on that veto. That's something I'm gonna have to live with. But it is what it is now. She'll get it. She'll watch back and understand. She'll understand. Right now she thinks that it's just like trying to take the easier route. But when she watches it back and sees that we've had something going this whole time, she'll understand. She doesn't know those things. And I would be pissed too if I didn't know. If somebody told me you'll get it when you get it, I'd be like, fuck off. Yeah, for sure. Exactly. She almost guessed it. She, yeah, she did. Another alliance. Another alliance, but yeah. But I was like, whoa, okay, well. I'm not going to tell her, but. I mean, I'm sure she can put two and two together. She doesn't know who was with, anyways. 45 minutes ago, we had hands in the middle. We made this choice. No, my, well, no, nothing's changed. No, nothing has changed. Like, that time was more, like, more cut though. Yeah, it just, it's, the decision has been made. She handled it better than I thought. Mm-hmm. Me too. But she's pissed, so watch that she might go to people now, but. What can yeah, she's starting to get, like, on the aggressive, like, defensive side now. Like, yeah. attacking side. She's like, yeah. Like when she started calling the move dirty and yeah, like, yeah. I'm like, oh god. And it's like, I don't think. Oh, I knew as soon as you came, you said, we're playing this game clean. I was like, yeah. oh, here we go. The clean move for us is doing this though. Like we've said the whole time we're going to do this. It is. So it's dirty for her. But After this, we're one target panel. away from one of us winning this game. Exactly. It is what it is, man. Like it's a clean move for everyone else that's staying in the house. It's a dirty move to her, but it's clean for us moving forward, and that's all that really matters. You keep her. That's a dirty move. Yeah. Because we promised Tara. We promised everyone else that's a dirty. And Latoya. Yeah. At the end of the day, you took it. Balls, eh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, but honestly, like I'm not. I don't want to go downstairs and be goofy or anything. No, I'm about to rub I'm not leaving. Like it's actually a brutal. I'm not fucking leaving. It's actually a brutal night. Oh, actually, I probably. Like, and that is what I told Bray in the kitchen. Like, I don't want to be laughing and stuff. Run it. <sighs> God. Whatever. It's not gonna get any easier. What's that? Roll will be easy. <sighs> To get them out? Work out or no, something. Once, once we do it, it won't it. feel as hard. Yeah. It won't. It'll feel like relief. I'm literally not kidding. Like, this time tomorrow, when one of you guys are in the HOH room, well, it'll be forgotten. Yeah. Yep. What? I just you? have such a good feeling about tomorrow. I honestly do. One of you three are winning. I had a good feeling, too. We, oh, whenever we get good feelings. Look. I do have a good feeling. I had a bad feeling all day, and I think it was because of this. Mm hmm But now I feel good, I eh? feel weirdly good, too. Fuck. This game is ruthless. That was fucked. That was fucked. Was you did thing. so good. You did. Thank you. I didn't say a word. I literally didn't say it. I couldn't even look at her. Yeah, you would have said just that face <laughs> is killing me. I was just like... You did so good. <sighs> I loved exactly everything you said. Yeah, you did a really good job. I don't remember Thank what I said. You. I blocked out. Yeah. Blocked yeah, out. well, I like blocked out. You were out firm. Too. Bad cop. At that point, it's like... It's a cake enough. There's no more. Enough. Like, like I feel bad, but it's like, this is the move we've already made, so I'm not going to, like, lead you on anymore. On her like, HOH, she's going to see how hard you worked to get both me and LT yeah, off. Yeah, yeah. Like, <sighs> she's going to see that we've been and together. how frustrated we were in rooms. How we've been coming in, it. leaving, coming in. Leaving. All the behind the door sallies we've had together with nobody else. Exactly. 
she doesn't know about all that stuff. Like, it's different once you hear, once you know about that stuff. It's way different. Oh, fuck. Whatever, I'm happy we just came together and we made a decision. It's best for us moving forward, because at the end of the day, it's all that matters. These four are here, this is it. This is it. So, we're always gonna come together, make a decision. Honestly, this HOH cleared a lot of fucking stuff up for us. It did. It really did. I feel like it really tightened our shit up. No, like, <laughs> it actually did. It did. It did. Like, if we weren't sure about this before, like, I think after this week, we can see that this is it. Like, this a is lot it. of stuff out. Anything that was, like, questioned or before, like, there's no questioning. That this is where the loyalty is. No, we know Brayden's gap. Yeah. We know Rowan's, like, the, we've confirmed he's the biggest liar in the house. Yeah. Tina, you know? oh. No oh, shit. Yes. 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 Imagine this is back. Oh, baby. Odd balls, eh? Odd balls, eh? Odd odd balls. <laughs> ODB. Oh, Brayden. Oh, I just want to shower. I'm and glad sleep. I'm in Defender. Oh, my God. Oh my gosh, that's a brutal evening. Brutal, brutal, brutal. You won't do it. You won't do it tonight. Do what? Oddballs, eh? It's not a fucking no. Chance. Don't I fucking do it tomorrow. No, I'm doing it tonight. Wait, how did it go? Should I? Okay. Better than anticipated. Sh better than yeah. She tried to fight me. She also might have a secret veto. She tried to. Yeah. When? When, when she left. What'd you say? Just like, oh, like, I know, like, they told me you were talking shit about me all day. Really? Yeah. Oh, one of the oddballs, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I just got from my What's going on? No, I was just saying what she, like, yelled at me over the balcony. Oh, yeah. Did there. she say something? Yeah, yeah I was there for like, that. Oh, I, I know you've been talking shit about me all day, so. Uh, what did what? you, you say? I was like, about what? She's like, about how much you don't want me here and, like, how much you hate me being here. Sorry, what happened? She said that we like, were talking shit about him all day. That we don't want him here, yeah. She yelled it over the balcony. She's like, oh, like, I know that you don't want me here. You've been talking shit about me all day. Your name didn't even come up. You Your didn't even come up what? Literally, literally about what? Cool. Like, she's like, you don't want me here. And I was like, I literally told you I was on the fence. And I told you that this morning. And she went, mm -hmm. okay, then. I went into her room. Your name didn't come up. That's oh, crazy. So she Rose's shouted. name didn't even come up. Rose's so name. She shouted over what? the balcony. That's I thought you even dodged it. It was sick. Your name didn't come on one. Crazy. That's sick. Love that shit. Well, she, 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 also, like, she, she was like, obviously it started off as her like crying and being very sad. Of course. And then we like deliberated a bit. Then she came back and then like it turned into like a more aggression when she realized that we were sending her. So that's when we had to just kind of cut we it off. We just said like you can't last another week. Like, it's crazy. She's like just send me home next week. Just send me home next week. I'm like what's the difference between this week and next week? If you want to just go home next week, what's the difference? Jury. Potentially. Shut up, bro. <laughs> You're right, though. <laughs> bro. Shut the fuck up. Fuck. Well, I got the same Don't time. Don't ever tell me shut up. <laughs> <laughs> so it was like, lay your ass down, boy. On the couch. <laughs> and then Tina was like, by the ball pad. Yeah, she just like yelled over the balcony. Like, she yelled from like the perch? No, like, from, 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 like, from, from my destiny. destiny. Yeah. Oh, from in front of Destiny. She's about to go in her room yeah. and she's like, yeah, I know, like, you've been talking shit about me all day. So. Wow. I was like, wow. what? You actually She's didn't like, you've been talking shit about me all day. You didn't come up once. She actually brought, yeah, she came, she talked about you, but we, we shouldn't. Uh, we didn't I, couldn't, I couldn't even say anything. I was just like. And I was like, what? And she's like, yeah, you don't want me here all day. You've been saying it to everyone. You can't pay for me to go. Jesus. And I was like, I never, I was like, I told you this morning, I didn't know where my vote lied. So no, I didn't. She's like, okay, then. I went to her room. So that like Wednesday night hangout ain't happening again? No. What do you think? The, the, the Wednesday night kumbaya before eviction day? No. I knew that was a dumb idea. <laughs> well, like, we knew it was going to get to a point where, like, someone isn't happy. Like, Kyle was probably the most, like, mature person I've ever seen with an eviction. That was never happening. That's never happening again. Yeah, like. I mean, Austin wanted that. Well. But then we got. We were up all night. Yeah. Calendar. <laughs> yeah. So. Did you want that? Would I want that? Yeah, probably. Unless, like, you obviously did me, like, really, really dirty. <laughs> <laughs> well, just, like, don't. Oh, like. Like, what's doing you dirty? Backdooring? Yeah, but like, but then like, if you're like mean to me all week. Oh, uh, yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? 
mean to you? Yeah, oh, like, really like, rude, like, yeah, like ignoring me all you. week. Yeah, yeah. And I'd be like, no, like, I don't want to fucking hang out with that. <laughs> I won't play 21 fucking questions. Really, like, no, let me go to fucking sleep. <laughs> Alaskan cruise. Like, I'm like, let me escape this hellhole. Yeah, no, that's fair. I was waiting for Tara to get called for batteries. Tara? Where to come in? <laughs> oh, come in here? With, yeah, with the, batteries. I was with waiting. Vic? Yeah, I was oh. waiting for it to be like, Tara, please arrange a house wide battery change. We honestly thought, like, after we told her, like, that she can go out and have to do batteries and come back in. That would no. be really weird. We'll see her. Big brother knows better than that. Yeah, they, they surely they, they re can read the room. Read the yeah, but fucking room. Shady. The bananas? Yeah, they're shady. They're petty. They're like, ha, let's set this up. All the bananas on the counter. Victoria. Jed. Jed. What? What? Get it? What? So it's for dinner tomorrow, he? Yeah. Pizza. Hmm? A pizza? What? Leftover pizza. Dinner? I don't know. Oh, yeah, I we might don't, be on a slop. Oh, it's true. I'm going to eat a bunch of pizza tomorrow. Because it could be the last slop of this season. Hopefully. Let it ride, Bruce. Let it ride. Let it ride. A little shady over there with your little hat perched on top of your head. So my grandfather wears his hat. I look like one of those boys at the club. In the booth? Oh, that's Hello, shiny. Goes, hey. hey, you with the booty. Move Yo, me. you. Come here. Yo, red dress, red dress. Yeah, you. Mm. Come here. Yo, white shoes, white shoes. So you got a man or what? <laughs> that works? Yeah. Apparently, they think it do. Hi. How you doing? <laughs> Down on the bike, you. Keepers on the hunt for a bride. Do you have a line? Do you have a line? You know? do I have a line? Yeah. No. I could do real <laughs> not having a line. What? Roll What's your line? What's your line? Me? Yeah. Yo, shorty. Yo, shorty. Yo, shorty. You feel me? I you gave little shorty. I give Latoya a one too. You guys saw? Were you guys there? It was I really there, good. But I yeah, heard about I it. Saw that. I saw it that. It was really good. She LT was down. That's when she decided she didn't like Kyle because he swung and missed so hard. Oh my god, <laughs> Kyle! Yeah, that was bad. That was bad. Dun, 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 dun. Not be brawling at bedtime. Huh? Not be brawling at bedtime. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> like, be just a good night, uh, Paca. Destiny, eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Yo, I'm sick with you, bro. Destiny. Anyway. No, no, no. Uh, no, you're not. What? You're uh, Destiny. You can sleep on the Everyone's velvet. Everyone's for defenders. Yo, this velvet's fire. Ooh. You can sleep on the blue velvet. This they is actually a dope velvet. couch to sleep on. I think my bed will rock on this. Who blew their nose in my bed? Like, what the fuck is that? It was probably back. She was in there. Oh. Not I. Me. I don't care. Tissue. Taisha? Yeah, look at him. Ignoring it. He also can't do two things at once, so maybe he genuinely... I know. He's not listening. You're a bad multi-listener. Huh? You're totally one of those people who text and can't hear at the same time. Yeah, that's my mom. That's my sister. And then and I'm, I'm like... I'm literally in the biggest story of my life, and she's like... <laughs> ding! Literally. And I'm like... Ah. And they're like, sorry, what? Okay. Like, sorry, say it again. Sorry, what? And you're like, it's fine. Or Whatever. this. Always. And I'm like, Pissed what off. are you, what are you reading? Instantly irritated. Oh, instantly. Nothing, it's fine. Literally. <laughs> How are you doing? Get to work. Get to work. Get to work, partner. My keeper gets out of the room. Get out. That room's gonna be awesome. Good. That room, my room's gonna be holding the door shut. <laughs> Dude, my room's gonna be ox tonight. Huh? My room? She's just probably gonna be shit talking. Oh, to me oh shit. Like, fucking Brayden, man. 
and everyone's gonna go. Are you kidding me? What is happening in there, Deshaun? I don't know the right We'd thing. have a small fucking window here, bud. <laughs> What is wrong with this? What's the fucking Sean? Brayden, go help him. What's the fucking prank? I can't be an, an accessory to Brayden, come. you're in. Never mind, I figured it out. What are you doing? The wrong thing kept turning on. The shower head. I don't, you're not that much you're all involved now. You're I'm all not. fucking Can't involved. let me out of the room. You're not going anywhere, Brayden. I'm not going to bad the cat. I just have such a to calm down. Don't have too much. I didn't ask for this. It's a lot. Uh, actually, that's probably one. Where are you putting it? In her bag? It's wet. Huh? It's a, it bag. It'll go everywhere. it's a bag of water, Raiden. Yes, of course. I think you can be able to pick that up. Huh? I think you can be able to pick that up. To tie it shitty. We have a small window here, Tushan. Huh? How much time we got? Probably 30 seconds. Oh, this is too heavy. Fuck. Just saying. put it in there. I told you. It's gonna be fine. Fucking Beavis and Bite it over here and have a listen. Untie it. It's in, untie it. Untie it? Yeah. Yes. Once it's in there, sitting good, you untie it. I hate that I'm involved in this now. Same, and you lock the door. You're just as guilty as me. How am I locking the door? There's no lock. You I'm just, the door. I pick here to stand. I pick here to stand. You're you could leave at your own free will man. at any You're time. You're a very intimidating man. What am I supposed to do? Anyways. <laughs> This pranking shit has gone oh. too far. That one's gonna be ugly. <laughs> no, yo, the one she's... Yo, you're gonna be cheese. What? My, the one she did to me? Yo. She'll be cheese about this one. No, I think yours is worse. You think so? Yeah. You know how much water's in there? You think mine's worse than this? I don't know what she did to you. But I feel like I might get hit. <laughs> oh, shit, I don't wipe the floor. Oh, uh, what a rough night. What a rough game. Jesus Christ. I really thought I was gonna brawl. <laughs> it's crazy how she did that, because you never came up once. Yeah, she's like, the, like basically insinuating, like, you guys said I, like, I talk shit about her all day to you, and that was, like, the reason. It was more of an emotional plea of how she deserves to be here, and how it's just like... Yeah. She doesn't want to go home this week. She wants to go home next week. Like, <laughs> I didn't hear a thing you said. I'm glad. Talking more smack? No, not about you, bro. It's the bit's getting old. We might have to actually be fucking friends. Really? That's the, the best thing I've heard all season. No, of course not, Rohan. I'm fucking mortal <laughs> Why do you enemies. Say like that? <laughs> Rohan. <laughs> say his name again. Rohan. <laughs> You're like, of course not, Rohan. I like how Beth says his name, so I Rohan. try to say Rohan. Where are you, Rohan? <laughs> Rohan. She Beth. says it like I live in Calgary. Yes, it's so hilarious. <laughs> I love it. Also, it's, it's a good name, though. Calgary. It is a good, it's a strong name. Oh, if I had a Calgary? cat, I would probably yeah, name it Calgary. Rohan. Yeah. So I could be Calgary. mean to it. Calgary. <laughs> Calgary. No, I'm Calgary. fine. I love cats. Thank you. I hate when people in name, Melbourne say Toronto. Toronto? Say what? Toronto. Toronto? Toronto. Toronto? 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 Yeah, a lot of people have Melbourne a bit. Toronto. Oh, like they say every single word. Yeah. Toronto. Toronto. How, Toronto? How, okay, this is how I say it. Toronto. I say Toronto. 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 People say Calgary. 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 Calgary? Toronto. Down in Calgary. Toronto. So Toronto. weird. Toronto is so weird. Toronto? Toronto. Toronto. Toronto? Toronto. 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 Do people from Vancouver hate people called Vancouver or do they, hate, do they prefer Van? They don't like Vancouver? No, they, they like Van. They like they, Vancouver. They prefer Van, right? Y yeah, they prefer Van. And they're like, I'm going to I Vancouver feel. this summer. They're like, you're going to Van? Yeah, I say I'm going to Van. Van City. Van City. Van? I've only been once. 
I love Vancouver. Does Montreal have something? Probably my different? favorite city. Do we nice. Know? Hmm? Does Montreal have something? And different? I've been to Calgary, Edmonton, Montreal. Ottawa, MTO? Toronto. The MTO. MTO. Where else have I been? My favorite Vancouver, city. Victoria. Not many. I want to go to all the biggest, big ones. Are you serious? Yeah. Hmm? Been to like all the big Canadian cities. Oh really? Oh, I haven't been to Quebec or Montreal. Yeah. Like, so Quebec you City. Haven't. I really want to go to Montreal. I had a, had a trip planned to Montreal last year. Didn't oh, happen. Damn. damn. Got shut down by the COVID. The COVID the took my plans. Days. They canceled all my airplanes and. Let's fucking shower in fucking peace. Hers is worse? Yeah. And a bag full of water? Yeah, I think I'll be pissed. Like, you're actually cheesed. All right, I gotta go check on what this is. It's gotta be clothes. It's gotta be clothes related. Uh, no, I don't know. Maybe. All right, might as well pull the band-aid off. And coming around Did the you river. switch your thing? Huh? Did you switch your legs? Hmm? Did you switch your legs? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Shut up. Of course. Of course. Mm-hmm. It's not for to see what is mine. Quarterback. Well, it's not my clothes. Maybe not. Maybe I actually won't care, actually. You could actually not care, potentially. Okay. Okay. It's gone too far. I told you, you do fast. This is done. What's in it? What do you think? Conditioner and water, but this smells like garlic. Oh, it's so annoying. I heard it's worse. I think I over this. Oh, God. I just picked it up and found yours. That was in my hair? I'm cheesed. Wait, are they cheesed? I would have found, found this. Oh, I have to. She's not, she's not in the chest for her. You know what? I put Ooh. my and stuff in oh. a hairspray bottle. I check, I've been checking everything. Okay. What the fuck? It stinks. <laughs> what, really? <laughs> I gotta smell shit in my hair. <laughs> it's a familiar smell in the bathroom. I don't think hers is worse. I think that's oh worse. I don't, do not warn her. I will say well. too good. Bray, you're in. Shut the fuck up. You're the fucking thing in. in. You're definitely in. You guys can smell it? It stinks. It fucking stinks. I used to put garlic on my pimples. What? That's different than your hair being soaked. My grandma said it worked. She's Jamaican. Garlic on pimples? She's Jamaican though. So you know, nah. Jamaican remedy. You know what Jamaicans call pomegranate pronganauts? Hmm? What do they call them? <laughs> pronganauts. I believe that. Why are there always band-aids around this fucking That's what my stepdad calls them. Jamaicans call everything the wrong name. And he calls, uh, they call avocados pears. Yeah, they call everything the wrong name. They call like, people the wrong name.
No talking after you leave here. What a day. What a There'll day. Be no convos tonight in there. Couldn't if I wanted to. Oh, am I talking to myself tonight? <laughs> so, Tina, Tara, how'd your chess match go earlier? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tina, you're 2 0? <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Crazy. So, evictions tomorrow. Fuck me. Oh, man. I'm going to stay in here until they tell me to go to bed. It's actually not a bad idea. <gasps> Although, I took like three naps today, so they're probably pissed. But they said it's okay, they'll warn you. What? It's like, Rohan. They don't even say nap time's over anymore. They just say my name. Damn. Wow. They know I know. But as soon as they say it, I'm up and I'm out. Damn. Like, I just need a quick 10. Sometimes that's all you need. Yeah. I like doing it when there's lots of people around, though, so. Yeah. You know? People are talking. Mm hmm. Keeper. Keeper, keeper, keeper. As the second most like like guy from Howdy Guy. I are. think your mom's wearing a road show t-shirt, I'm not gonna lie. You son of a bitch. <laughs> she probably is. You know, I like that <laughs> you little your, your buddies are trying to sell your mom a key t-shirt <laughs> and she's just not buying. She wouldn't buy her key feet. She'd want it for free for sure. Mine are going to be premium quality tees. Because you're rich. No. Ty, though. Who? Urban planners these days? Don't lie. Listen. 140000 a year minimum starting salary. Starting sal? Whoa. Working six months out of the year. 46, bro. Million? 46 before taxes. Starting sound? Crazy. No. Go ahead. I'm making more money with you guys. Than who? With you guys. With us? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? You know what I mean. Like you're gonna win the game? No. Not what I mean. Oh, because we're not spending anymore. Yeah, me too. Well, yeah, sure, sure, sure. I don't know. Getting our bi weekly cuts. So I need that money. Hmm? More than anything. Yeah. Are you still getting your salary paychecks right now? My paycheck? You're calling the show. Why? So I can call in and talk I'd to have you. to be there. What? Yeah. I'd have to be there. No, then I would. Where are you? Where at are home. You? But you can't call into the show from home? No, because I wouldn't be there to answer. Uh, Where do you do the show from? Work. So if you're at work doing your show, <laughs> and I call in while you're at work. It's a very small window. How small is the window? What time? Five minutes to an hour and a half. Then I just go home. So you, you're on the radio for 45 to an hour and a half? No, I'm on the radio for six hours. So the, call, so the call in time is 45 to an hour? No, I don't even answer the phones. Okay. Bro, I think that's a little show. It's mayonnaise. It's mayo. It's barbecue. So you guys have a ninth caller today? No, we don't have... Well, we do that sometimes, but not usually. Yeah. No. I go in, I pre-record my spots throughout the day. I plan my bits, my promos. I record them. They're in the system. And then from my phone, we have a program where I can go in and switch the music and right. time my hour out so the news plays at the top of the hour. It's a really great system, and I could do it for the rest of my life if this is how it would be. It pays pretty well, too. Crazy. Oh. Yeah. 13 an hour? <laughs> Way more than that. Is it 13? 13.75. No. <laughs> no, it's around where Ty is. What? Where you're, where you're at with Urban Planet, that's... 
kind of close to where I am. I don't know. How you know how much I'm making? How do I? You just said 46. 46 what? Exactly. That's a starting salary, he said. Yeah. For his profession. Yeah. That's. Yeah, I'm making more than that. So you trying to flex on me? No, I'm oh. not. You trying to flex on me? I'm just saying. Mm-hmm. My guy. That's what we do. And I side hustle everything I can. I'm always, I'm always working. The only time I take vacation days is to work. Mm-hmm. What's your side hustle? Everything. Speaking primarily, hosting events, mm-hmm. talking to youth, doing workshops, sure. things around there. Coaching basketball? Coaching Not basketball. yet. Not yet. DJ cooking glasses. glasses, yeah. Working with kids. Being a dad. Dad has taken over pretty much all of that. But I still do a lot of speaking events go to like different conferences around Canada, mm-hmm. tell them about my story. We mm-hmm. started a great thing on Hadagwai called the Hadagwai Youth Assembly. Yeah. And it really, it teaches kids about governance mm-hmm. and it's adaptable to almost any surrounding. Mm-hmm. And it's an impactful thing that we do. And like, it's all over YouTube and stuff. And it's been widely successful and we kind of just built it from the ground up. It's been like an eight year running thing now, seven year running thing. Mm-hmm. And yeah, I go and I talk about that and I, Try to tell other communities how they can do it and adapt it. Because as a First Nations person, you're governed by your tribal leadership. You're governed by your matriarch system, your hereditary system, by the provincial government, by the Canadian government, and potentially by a municipality who's close to your town. It's Mm -hmm. tough to navigate through all those things. Nobody teaches you how to navigate through that and exactly how a band council can help you get far or how you can work through the municipalities. Mm -hmm. Good for you. You know, just trying to help the kids out. And I also fight to desegregate like conferences because right. there's a lot of indigenous conferences. Yeah. Just because they're indigenous doesn't mean they should just be for indigenous people. Right. It right. should be for everybody. Yeah. Why are we excluding when we felt like we were excluded for so long? Right. I won't be a part of those. Right. Good for you. Right on. You know, I'm also half white. So that's partially it. We need to break down those racial boundaries. There should only be traditional and cultural boundaries, and even those can be broken down. Because eventually we're all just going to be one mixed up bunch of good looking humans. A lot of mixed people in here. Yep. Yeah, my mom is. If if I ever went to H.O.H. again, I'll probably see a picture of her. She's like a five foot two white lady. Your mom? She's probably the same size as Tara, actually. Mm-hmm. But maybe even a little skinnier. Did What's your, mom, your dad look like? Is your mom tall, Brent? My dad's a smaller native guy. He's probably like 5'6, five, 5'7. Five, mm-hmm. He's got long hair, mm-hmm. goatee, mustache, really dark. Has a really deep voice. Mm-hmm. And he always thinks about what he's going to say. Very wise. He's a good dude. Terrible golfer. Just kidding, Dad. Hey. Oh, you beat him all the time? Yeah. He just started golfing. Like, he just, just started. How long have you been doing? Uh, I used to play a lot when I was a teenager. Oh, no. He's also in his 60s. And his clubs are worse than mine. That doesn't help. No. I want to pick it up. He beats me on a bunch of holes. He beat me one time uh, through 18. You shaved one. For real? Yeah. I was just having a bad day. That was funny. But he was hit, he was he was hitting big. We golf all the time. Five a.m. Yeah, f- five thirty a.m. We get out the door, go get our coffee, and then go hit the course. Just me and my old man. I love that. It, yeah, me too. I wouldn't trade it for anything. That's probably the first thing I'm gonna do is do like, well, once I'm not jet lagged or tired, let's probably do a morning round of golf with the old man. It's like my dad and I with tennis, though. We go hard on that tennis court. Yeah? I wouldn't even want to play you in tennis. You're so long. So I'll fun. play you in tennis. No, I like I like playing. Yeah. yeah let's Recreational. Do it. Yeah, let's do it. I'm not great. Yeah, but you're long as hell. It's so much fun. I got a homie who's 6'4", and when I play him in tennis, it's just stupid. I'm running all over the court, and he's just like this. Doof. Doof. I'm just like, this is fucking dumb. We still play though. High Park, great tennis court over there. 
Where? You know Hyde Park is? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Hyde Park. Uh, one of my favorites. I love that area of Toronto, that west. West End, yeah. That west yeah, end. Yeah, I grew yeah. up kind of around there. Yep, Hyde right. Park is the place to be. Expensive houses. Oh my god, I know. Expensive city. Wouldn't live anywhere else, though. Really? No, I would. <laughs> I like Bantu a lot. I don't know if I could live there, though. Why? Just don't know enough people? No, I, I wouldn't be worried about the people part as much. I think it'd be like... Well, it's far from my family. That would be one part. Yeah. And then, like, the glute, the cloudy thing. I've never seen it, but I heard about it. What do you mean the cloudy thing? It was cloudy all winter for, like, oh, yeah. six months straight of clouds. I don't know about six. Three? Huh? Three months straight of just gloomy days? I think that's true oh, that. If, yeah, okay, you can never live where I can. I don't? Yeah. It's like that there, too? Yeah, but for, like, six months. Oh, no, 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 no. No sun. Always rain. Nope. No, no snow, though. I'd rather snow. Oh, my God. I'd rather snow and sun than clouds the whole time. I almost cried when I was standing in the rain when that one day we got rain. Huh. I was so happy to be in the rain. Oh, it felt like home to you? Oh, I used to coach soccer. I had two soccer teams on the go, and each team would practice two times a week, and we'd have a game on uh, Saturday. So it was five days a week we're playing outside all day. In the rain? In the rain. Whatever it was. We would play in windstorms. We never canceled the game, ever. There's lightning, we just waited for the lightning to be over. And we kept playing. Wait, so Haida didn't get snow? Never, barely ever. One, once, once a winter, it'll stick for maybe two to three days. Was Haida way more south than Terrace? Mm, not so much. But we are on an island. Is it coastal though, it's different. Like Haida compared to... Yeah. Like, yeah. So yeah. when you're inland, you get snow? Oh yeah, it's lots of snow. Like the other year, we got like 79 centimeters in 24 hours. Oh my gosh. I shoveled my driveway like six times. And my car was still buried in the morning. Like there's just nothing I could do. I hate it. Would you go back and live on Haida? As soon as the kids are, as soon as the girls are out of school. You'd go back? I'm going back. I want to die there. What's the lifestyle like on the island? Slow. You said Good it's slow, vibes. very community-based, right? Very community-based. There's just always something to do. Really? Oh, yeah. Always. Always something on the go. Always people to hang out with. And it's just like, you ever been through something really hard? When you go through something really hard on Haida Gwaii, you go through it with everybody. Everybody's got you. It's not like that in this city. You walk around, you gotta go grocery shop, shopping. People don't know what you're going through. On Haida Gwaii, they do, and they got you. It's just something that can't be recreated anywhere else. Wow. I wanna be there for the good times and the bad. So you lived there, went to high school there, everything? Yep. Growing up. So you were there until you were about 18, you went to Kelowna? Mm, I went to Kelowna when I was like 20. 20. And it was about for six, seven months. And I moved back to Haida Gwaii to work. I got a job there, and then I, yeah, I just showed up to that basketball tournament one day, and I was like, you got to let me call these basketball games. Like, I was meant to do this. That's all that happened? Yeah. I literally just showed up, and I was supposed to leave back to Haida Gwaii because I had no money, but I ended up winning, like, two grand in the casino, and my homie convinced me to stay, and I slept on his hotel room floor. And when I was sleeping on the floor, my work, the, where I work now, called me and asked if I could be at the gym in 30 minutes to call a morning like the radio? game. Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. That's and how I, you got the job? Yeah. I just showed up and I told him I'd be good. I was like, I was like, you won't regret giving me a chance. I was like, just give me one game. Just give me one game. And you were good at it from the jump. Mm. Like you were shit, but good enough for them to want to keep it. I was good at it from the jump. Oh, I knew I'd be good. I could call games in my head. I turn off NBA games and I call them. Every game we had at home, I'd be talking like a broadcaster, play by play. I never wanted to be the color. I always wanted to be the guy.
breaks the press all in his own. He's got one defender to beat. Goes in for the layup. Bang! He hits it. Something like that. Ah. Uh... That four bang! Yeah. Bang. Oh, bang is a. I, I have to say bang. Mike Breen. But usually when a guy's shooting lights out, I'll, I'll load him up with the click, click. So it'll be like uh, Kapoor at three, click, click. Bang! He hits it. Did you see what I did with the veto when I won? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and we got like, uh, like it's an indigenous basketball tournament, so like I say, like a lot of like things that only we'd get. When like there's a big steal, I'd be like, he took everything but his status card. Not that. Yeah. <laughs> Not that. <laughs> Whenever somebody gets hit the, hit in the eye, I'm like, oh, the good old sockeye salmon. Not that. Well, I've had some pretty pretty big calls. Yeah, definitely a Riz famous around there. Nice. Yeah, I wish I, someday I, I want to call a raps game somehow. I would be so mm. fucking good. I believe that. <laughs> Even the guy that just says their names after they score makes bank. Yeah. I would be really good at that. That's dope. My stepmom went to school with him. Really? Yeah, I used to call games that used to do the same thing at our college. And then suddenly got, got in with the raps, and he's been doing it for years. All he does is pretty much, like, talk shit all game and say whoever scores. Damar. The Rosen. Yeah, that'd be cool. But I don't see it happening. I'm good with where I'm at with that tourney. I'd want, I'd want to do it for the rest of my life. Even though it's only nine days out of the year, and there's two tourneys. Under nine days, so 18 days out of the year, I'm calling games. Then we do a couple other tournaments, but they're not as big. That's on the island or in Paris? It's in, in Prince Rupert, and then the other one's somewhere throughout BC. Goes to Vancouver, Nanaimo, Kelowna. Which one? That's the indigenous games? Uh, the Junior All Native. Junior. It's the biggest. Uh, it's the biggest tournament in BC. Junior. What well, juniors? To how old? Under 18? Uh, yeah. There's. Two divisions under 18, and then there's two divisions U13. So four different divisions, usually about 80 or 90 teams. Yeah, and only four teams can be champions. So. What is it, what champ? Uh, it's like a lip mask. It's basically like Vaseline, but it's scented. Oh, oh. Thank you. Do I go in the room and say good night? No. Really? I mean... Do I go in there and sleep? Yeah. Where's my water bottle? You oh. want to. I think they're already like laying down. Ty just went in there to get his clothes. So I'm waiting for him to come back. Oh, uh, yeah. Why doesn't he move his clothes to the Defender? So if he comes back and he says it's fine, <laughs> then I will go in and say good night. How is that? Is that it? Is that it right there? We need you into the room. Yeah. How is that? Huh? How is that? What do you mean? Did you want to do Destiny or Defender? I want to Destiny. Are you crazy? Oh. How so are you trying to get your clothes, though? Huh? How are you trying to get your clothes? Why don't you go in with Ro? Actually, right I'm going to sit out here with you guys. I don't even think of that. Why don't I just sleep? Oh, I can't go in there. Can you go in there and grab some boxers? <laughs> you want boxers? Yeah. Uh, Okay, then tell me how it is. Okay. It's, to the, it's in the... In the drawer? You know, my, my big drawers? Yeah. It's in the small drawer to the right of it. Top. Top shelf. Yeah. Thanks, big guy. Oh, that's ugly. Oh, Are the see. lights still on? Huh? No. Oh, okay. I want to see Beth get pranked. You're not going to see it. It won't be till tomorrow. She's not moving until tomorrow? No. No. That's a last minute thing. 
Or like, you're fucking kidding me. Deshaun. Ty. I was like, Ty balling. <laughs> How you doing, girl? I think she'll be passed. I think she'll be annoyed. Hey, that, that's a lot of water. That's... It depends on if it's in the morning or not, and she has nothing to wear for the eviction. Hey, that'll suck. <laughs> hey, that'll suck. Shut yeah. up. Yeah. Okay. It's already black in there. I'll go in the door open. Uh -huh. You got soft on me? Dude, it's I didn't know it was dark in there already. I, I thought the know. lights were on. <laughs> Dude, you think I'm about to pin the door open and start ruffling through the drawers for your goddamn drawers? Uh-uh. <laughs> oh man. I wish. I want to throw this in my hair, but I think it'll stain the ass. What? What is it? Just go around. Oh. You want to do what? What does it do for the hair? Can I just moisturize that? Can I throw it on my beard, do you think? Yeah. I do have beard oil at home, I just didn't bring it. What? Why is this cold? It's deeper to put in there. You probably would get a courtesy. He's a nice guy. Nobody's in there. I didn't even notice that. It no, because he wants to go in there. I didn't, I didn't shit. He didn't shit. Oh, okay. Yeah. Jesus Christ, Deshaun. What the loser is fucking. Fuck. Bro, Gets people me. don't put him on slop. I couldn't handle him. Him? Yeah. Who should I put on slop? Whoever else you want. I really don't care. You guys gonna volunteer? No. No. Nobody's gonna volunteer for me. We're too, we are too, you don't put bread on. Huh? Jeez. I'm wanting you to pass me. Oh, that's evil. That's evil. I told you he's the puzzler. You're evil Puzzler. Me. Me. He said he wants to put me on slot. Is that what people are saying? I don't know. I think it's a hero. Huh? I think it's a hero. The hero? The underdog. The underdog. One three vehicles. Some underdog shit. Damn. Drive the block six times. The hero. Trying to go lay in the back? Yeah. Okay. I'm just scared like you guys are in there. I'm just chilling. I just don't want to walk alone. I know I'm not going to fall asleep until you come to bed anyway, so what's the point of... You're sleeping. Of course, because I like to it, sleep. No, no, no. Everyone's asleep. Don't Big bother. Big fan. Sure? Yep. Big fan of sleep. I mean, you can if you want, but... Okay, I don't care. Big fan. Good night, everyone. Good night. Love you all. Good night. Were they up? Really? Well, like they're awake, they're not like wide awake. Where's that oh. water bottle? Oh no. This is no good. No good at all. Do 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 is do my water bottle. Do. Perfect. Thank you. I'm gonna have to hide it from you people. Strange. What do you mean, a strange? Huh? Eh? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Balzi. Yeah, I can't imagine. I've been very heavy. I can't believe she went out either. I thought it would be more. I can't believe it, but... I thought it was going to be more. Ro was like, that was very... Tina and Ro were like, that was very tame. Um, with, like, obviously she was saying things about you. Of course. But it wasn't things that you haven't heard that she said before. It's the same shit she said it right in front of everybody at the house yeah, meeting. Yeah, that's what I was listening And then, like, we... <laughs> 
we're like we're not here to talk about that yeah like why like we're here talking about you yeah it's about you girl and then yeah so she left and then we like deliberated it wasn't yeah, much deliberated. of <laughs> wasn't much of a deliberation it was just like fuck of course because you feel bad yeah I would I, I do feel bad yeah no I know because she, she's thinks that me to Sean and Jed are the only votes that she could get mm-hmm. so she was hoping for a tie of course and that Beth would keep her so I was like oh my god yeah it's literally as soon as she left she like walked out but like walking to desk and he was like right here and she's like oh. like basically like insinuating that you guys said that I was ta- that I was talking shit about her she's yeah, like oh I know you're talking shit about her all day did not happen so and I was like what She's like, yeah, you've been trying so hard to get me out of this game all day today, Brayden, so thanks a lot. And I was like, what are you talking about? I was like, Rick, I literally told you that I didn't know where my vote was. I said, I'm honestly debating, but I'm, you know, strongly leaning towards one side, and I literally told it to you this morning. And she said, whatever, and I'm strong for her. And I was like, oh. I thought it was going to be brawl. Well, let's go. Here we are. 